Good afternoon. This is Virginia State Senator Jeff McWaters uh, speaking to you today from Richmond, Virginia. It's cold outside and snowy yesterday, but I think we've done well down at Hampton Roads with snow removal. And I hope you're uh, home and, and safe uh, or are able to even go to work. Wanted to report to you what we've been doing up here in the last week or so. We're now into our third plus week of the General Assembly session. And you know, in politics, we say that every vote matters. And that can't be said more about the elections that just took place a few weeks ago, uh, particularly in the Norfolk Eastern Shore, the 6th Senate District of Virginia. Uh, we lost that, I'm told now, by about 11 votes. And so every vote matters. Six votes just going the opposite way or 12 voters would have changed that outcome. It's a massive outcome because when we went into session, we had uh, 20 in the Virginia Senate that were Republicans and 18 Democrats. And there were two open positions, and so one of those positions, uh, both of those positions, in fact, recently went to the Democrats, so it's 2020. However, uh, we have a Democratic lieutenant governor now for the first time in eight years, and so in essence, they have the working majority, the Democrats do, in the Virginia Senate. And while we're all here to work in a very bipartisan way to get things done for Virginians and focus on business and jobs and education and transportation and military families issues, uh, we unfortunately get caught up in other things from time to time, and already we're starting to see that happen, particularly with social issues. Uh, so we'll try to navigate those waters, but we're now in the minority. The Republicans uh, are now in the minority. I've, always been on, I've been on as many as uh, four committees and uh, chairman of uh, three or four subcommittees over my time here, but now we're relegated to uh, minority status uh, in, those, uh, in those committees. So. It's much harder to get bills passed. It's, uh, in some cases, virtually impossible. And for them, it would be much easier to get uh, their agenda move forward. We'll watch this very closely. Uh, again, I'm fearful of the social issues that appear from both sides of the aisle, frankly, as we should be focused on jobs, economic development, and families. I hope you're uh, tuning into our emails. We're trying to summarize the week every week. Uh, uh, if you have a question, send us uh, info at jeffmcwaters.com or feel free to call our office while we're up here in Richmond. We're working very hard. Love to have any great ideas on economic development that you have. If your company's thinking of expanding, if you're an entrepreneur and you're looking for an opportunity to grow your business or start a business in Virginia, or if your company has a division that's in another state that you think would be, would be better suited here in Virginia, we'd love to uh, work with you or your company and, and the new governor Terry McAuliffe, to do everything we can to help Virginians, uh, and uh, so we're very dedicated to that. Well, look, thank you very much for your time today. It's great to be with you. I'm Jeff McWaters. We hope to see you soon.